Testing one, two. Teacher. Hello, Mr. William. How are you? Hi, teacher. And you? I'm doing good. How was your day today? What, teacher? How was your day? Did you have a good day? Did you have a good day today? Yes? I have a nice day, teacher. Did you go to work today? Yes. Where do you work? I go in Santa Tecla. Ah, okay. Okay. I work. Um, Close. Well, I used to work in, in Ica. Do you know where Ica? What? Do you know where Ica is? In Santa Tecla? No, teacher. Ah, okay. Where do you live, William? I live in Lourdes Colón, teacher. Ah, okay. So you have a is there a lot of traffic going to the house? Yes. Did you have a did you get a lot of traffic today? Yeah. Traffic going to your house? Yes. Yes. Okay. Teacher, estoy trabajando en los en los exámenes, en los literales. Okay. ¿Cuál cuál estás haciendo ahorita? Eh, ahorita me falta la E, si no me equivoco, y la A, pero son como unas dos que me faltan. Okay. Okay. Entonces esta semana hay te hay para terminar esta semana para que estés en las cuatro. Si estás en la 4, ya estás ahí con nosotros. Al final de la... Ahorita de la, ya estoy iniciando la 4. Ok. Al final de la sección, sección 3, hay un eh, examen de, de midterm. ¿Ya lo viste? El examen de la mitad. Uh -huh. yes. De la mitad del curso hay un examen. Así es. ¿Ya lo hiciste? Eh, eso ya voy en un 80 por ciento. Ok, ok. Good, good. Hello, Manny. How are you? Good evening. Now, so good. Good, good. I, I be a sick a few days ago. Ah, ok, ok. Do you feel better now? Yes? I feel better. Ok, good. Uh, check your camera because I can I cannot see you. Oh, it's I can not stay in my house. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, Estás manejando. Desde el teléfono. <laughs> manejando <laughs> y y en la en el, en el teléfono a la misma vez. Okay. Okay, so uh, William. Uh, Let me teach her. Hemos estado trabajando la, la sección 4 ahorita. No sé si ya viste algunos videos de la sección 4. En eso estamos ya, teacher, trabajando. Ok. Ok, ahora vamos a repasar unos videos de ahí. Hello, Carlos, how are you? Thank you, teacher. Good night. Good evening. 
Good evening, Carlos. Good, good to see you. Okay. Very good. So I have some uh, some questions that we're going to do. This is uh, some questions from section. This video is section cuatro punto dos. Creo que es. Okay. This video here. So, um, aquí hay dos tipos de preguntas. Number one, questions with do and questions with wh but también tienen do okay so questions with do do you like rap yes i do i like it a lot no i don't like it very much okay so when you answer you have to use do okay es El do va al, al inicio de la oración. Si uso does, mi respuesta va a tener does. Si uso do, mi respuesta va a tener do. Ok. So, si y uso el mismo verbo auxiliar con el que me están preguntando. Do you like rap? Yes, I do. Does he play the piano? No, he does. I mean, yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Okay. Now, aquí tengo what and does. ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué uso does? What does he play? ¿Qué, qué instrumento toca? What does he play? He plays the guitar. Okay. So, Porque uso does here. ¿Por qué? La tercera persona. Yes. Very good. Porque tengo he. Very good. Mm -hmm. Porque tengo he. So, mi pregunta, perdón, mi respuesta va a tener he. Okay. Very good. Another question. Do they like the Beatles? Entonces, yo voy a responder con do. Yes, they do. They love them. No, they don't like them very much. Okay. What do they like? They like you too. Okay. Ayer hicimos object pronouns. Okay. Ayer hicimos object pronouns. Estudiamos y repasamos object pronouns, subject pronouns, and possessive pronouns. Eh, possessive adjectives. So, ustedes deberían manejar el subject pronoun, el object pronoun, y el possessive adjective. So, let me go back. Excuse me. Okay. Let me go back. So, todos deberíamos de estar manejar los primeros tres. Subject pronouns, object pronouns, and possessive adjectives. Okay? Este es el nivel donde tenemos que estar. Okay? So, very good. Um, si no, si quieren ver un repaso de esto, ahí está la clase en YouTube de ayer. Okay, very good. So I have some questions for you here, okay? These questions, I'm going to put, uh, well, let's talk about them and then we're going to go into groups. Uh, do you see the question here? ¿Qué le tengo que poner enfrente? Do. Do or does? Do. Do, do. very good. Do you like rock music? Yes, I does, or yes, I do. ¿Cuál sería? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. Correct. If you don't like it, then you say, no, I don't. Okay? Very good. Then, uh, number two. Do or does? 
Does. Does. Does your mom like classical music? Yes, very good. Okay. Eh, ¿Por qué does? Estoy usando mom. Tercera persona. Tercera persona singular. Very good. Does your mom like classical music? Yes, she do. Or no. yes, she does. ¿Cuál sería la respuesta? Yes, she does. Yes, yes, she does. does. Very good. Mm -hmm. Están usando does, so yo voy a responder con does. Si usan do, respondo con do. Okay, what about this one? Does you like scary movies or do you like scary movies? Do you like scary movies? Yes, very good. What about this one? Do your parents like rancheras or does your parents like rancheras? Does your parents like your parents? En este caso sería do. ¿Por qué? Porque parents es más de uno. Papá y mamá. So, en este caso es plural, no es tercera persona singular. Okay. Podría decir, do they like rancheras? Podría sustituir. Okay. So, the next one, do he enjoy Chinese food or does he enjoy Chinese food? Does. Does he enjoy Chinese food? Yes. Yes, correct. Do they like going to the beach or does they like going to the beach? They like going to the beach. Do they like going to the beach? Very good. Okay, very good. So, uh, vamos a personalizar estas preguntas. Eh, vamos a usar para todas como si estuviéramos hablando con otra persona. Do you like Chinese food? Uh, do you like going to the beach? Okay. So, aquí está la respuesta. Answer, you're going to respond. Okay. So, we're going to do a, a conversation. We're going to go into groups and we're going to speak. Okay. To another person. You're going to speak to another person. Uh, the questions I'm going to put in the chat. De, um, en el chat de Zoom y en el chat de WhatsApp. Voy a poner las preguntas, ¿ok? Ok, give me a second. Ok, en el WhatsApp, for, uh, I'm going to put the questions also. Okay, let's go to groups and we're going to speak. You're going to ask the questions. ¿Cuáles preguntas? Las que le puse en el chat de Zoom y también voy a poner las mismas preguntas en el WhatsApp. Okay? So, let's go to... Deme un segundo que estoy teniendo problemas con el WhatsApp. Okay, let's go to groups. Now, we have seven people. Let's make uh, three groups. Okay. Uh, accept the message, join the group. Ok, did you find the questions? Eh, las preguntas están en el chat de Zoom o pueden, pueden también estar en el chat de WhatsApp. Yes, thanks. Eh, 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 eh. Mi 
con quién estoy en grupo, quiero ver. Carlos. Ok, Carlos, do you, ¿does your mom like classical music? Mm, yes. She, yes. She does. Yes, she does. Uh -huh. Correct. Ella te pregunta con does, tú vas a responder con does. Yes, she does. Very good. Okay. Do you, okay. Do you like a scary movie? Yes, they do. Okay, good. Do your parents like rancheras? Mm, no. Sería they... Don't. They, they don't. Okay, no, they don't. Mm -hmm. Do you like enjoy ch Chinese food? Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. I do. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. Do you like going to the beach? Yes, I do. Okay, very good. Ahora, Carlos, tú le vas a hacer las preguntas a Emerson. Okay. Good evening, Emerson. Good evening, Carlos. ¿Me escucha? Sí, lo escucho. Bueno. Do you like enjoy? Uh, uh, do you like Chinese sí, food? Ahí, ahí yo cometí un error, Nani. Yes, ¿Puede yes. ser enjoy o puede ser like? Eh, Edison, tener mucha... Okay, Manny, sorry, I, I, that question, it can be, do you like Chinese food? Chinese food? food? Do, you enjoy? do you enjoy Chinese food? Cualquiera de las dos, solo usa una palabra, enjoy okay. or like? Enjoy or like. Okay, so you're going to ask the question and then you're going to answer, okay? Creo que se escucha con bastante interferencia. I have a problem teaching. Okay. Si quieres sacarlo y ponerlo de regreso. La espiga. O será que tenés algún dispositivo cerca? Tal vez porque tenés algún tipo de dispositivo cerca o algo que está interfiriendo. I don't know. Okay, ahora suena mejor. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's better. Okay. Do, do you like Chinese food? Chi Chinese food. Chinese, Chinese food. food. Chinese food. <coughs> yes, I do. I, yes, I do like Chinese food. Okay, good. Do you like going to the beach? Yes, I like going to the beach. I like going to the beach. Okay. Do you like rock music? Mm, no, I don't like rock music. Does your mom like classical music? No, he don't like classical music. He or she? She. Uh, she. She. Sorry, sorry. She, she. Okay, good, good. Do you like square movies? No, I don't like a scary movies. Okay. Do your parents like rancheras? Yes, my parents like rancheras. Good, good. Do you like China food? Ya la Chinese. China. 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 Chinese food. Okay, good, good. Now it's uh, uh, Emerson, now it's your turn. Uh, I'm sorry, Manny, ahora okay. es tu turno. Now you ask the questions. Ya le preguntaste. Ya, ya. Ya, ya, ya le pregunté todo. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, we're going to go back now. Okay. 
And in, in one minute, we're going to go back. Okay, very good. So I, I hope that you had a chance to speak, right? Eh, algo notable. Si me, si me preguntan con does, respondo con does. Si me preguntan con do, respondo con do. Okay, remember that. All right, always. Okay, very good. So another uh, questions that we did, another type of questions is WH questions with do or does okay so i have some questions here uh first of all who can tell me what is the difference between questions with do or does and questions with wh what is the difference what is the difference hmm? oh. exactly very good so as you can see here I have information for these. Questions with do or does is only yes or no answer, okay? So I can respond with yes, I do, no, I don't, right now. But questions with WH, I have to give information, right now, como dice Emerson, son informativas, okay? Very good, Emerson, all right. So I have some questions here. Which one do I use here? Do or does? What kind of cell phone do or does you have? Do. Do. Do you have? Very good. Very good. What kind of cell phone do you have? Very good. Okay. Uh, here. What type of movies do or does? Do. Yes. Yes. What type of movies do you like? Very good. ¿Y qué pasaría si le cambio aquí el, el, el sujeto? He. Sería das. Sería das. Very good. Yes, yes. Good job. Do you like? What type of food do you like the most? Do. What type of books? do you like to read okay and the last question is what kind of videos do you watch on youtube okay so these questions okay ustedes se la, vamos a hacer lo mismo vamos a practicar again with the with the groups okay uh, i just want you to see here yo uso para decir para preguntar qué tipo o qué tipo de, de películas, qué tipo de libros. Ok, in English I can use kind, estas tres palabras aquí, type, kind, or sort of. Ok, estas palabras eh, ahorita no, 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 les, no les puedo explicar por qué eh, y cuándo se usa cada una. Ok, eh, pero type. And kind puede ser intercambiable. Okay. Very good. So I'm going to put these questions. Lo voy a poner en WhatsApp. Y la voy a poner en um, eh, Zoom chat. Como, como le sale mejor a ustedes. Um, okay. I'm going to put them there. Let's go to the groups now. And you're going to ask those questions. ¿Cuál preguntas? 
WH questions can do, okay? Let's go to the groups again. Okay, uh, Nineveh, uh, allow, go to join. There you go, perfect. <laughs> okay, okay, good. Did you see the questions? Yes? Yes. Okay, so Nineveh, eh, tú empiezas, tú le vas a preguntar a, a William. Okay. What kind of cell phone do you have? ¿Cuál era la respuesta, me dijo? La respuesta, yo, yo no sé, porque esta, esta solo tú la puedes responder. What kind of cell phone do you have? Nineve, ha, eh, ¿cómo tú responderías eso? What kind of cell phone do you have? I have a Samsung. I have a Samsung A30. Good, good job. Good job. Okay. We are okay. Uh, no, no, continue, continue, continue. Okay. Yes. okay. Mm -hmm. I have a ango. Pero no, casi no le escucho ahí. Un poquito tímido la voz. I have a ango. Android. Cell phone ango. Cell phone ango. Ango. Ah, okay, okay. No problem. It's okay. <laughs> Okay, question number two. Nineveh, go. What type of movies do you like? I like... Action. Movie, action movie. Okay. Hello, Gladys. Hello, teacher. How are you? Good, good. I, I put the questions that we're doing right now in, in WhatsApp and también in the chat the the, the Zoom. Uh, what kind of cell phone do you have? Esos son. Uh -huh. Esas. Uh -huh. Okay. Eso vamos a practicar. Sí. Okay, ya bye hicimos bye. la pregunta con do and does. Ahora vamos a hacer con wh más do and does. Okay, so go, you can take time. Pueden preguntarse uno al otro, ¿ok? So let's, let's do this exercise. Okay. Uh, five minutes, ¿ok? Ok. Go. Hello, Manu. Hello, Gladys. Yo te pregunto y tú me contestas para ver la dinámica, ¿ok? Ok. Porque no sé cómo tienes que contestar. Ok. Ok. What kind of cell phone do you have? I have... Uh, uh, one cell phone Huawei and one cell phone LG. Wow, you have two cell phones. <laughs> wow. Okay. But one is me, is mine, the other is the, the factory. Ah, okay, yeah. okay. Okay. What? What I? What type of movies do you like? I like comedy movies and um, adventure. Okay. What kind of food do you like? Do you like um, most? I like pupusas and pizza and hamburgers. Okay. What kind of books? Do you like to read? Um, I like read books about um, stories or adventure. Okay. What kind of video do you watch on YouTube? Um, music or and information. That's good. Good job. Okay. Now, uh, Emerson, 
¿Ya le preguntaron a Carla? No, eso vamos. Ok, go, go, continue. Ahora Good job. Ok. Hey, Carla. Hi. What kind of cell phone do you, do you have? I have a... Uh, <laughs> Sometimes Muy about bueno. food <risa> para, para aprender a cocinar, pero no lo cocino. <risa> ¿Entendió ahora? Sí, ahora sí. Ah. Teacher. Yes. Buena maestra, me pues. Ahí está. <risa> ok. Mira que, soy, mira que soy nuevo y estoy poniendo mandilla. Ok. Le voy a dar una. Así se dice. ¿Sí? Le voy a dar un truco para que suenen como más, más amplio su inglés. Uh -huh. eh, la palabra example, for example, uh -huh. eh, puede oh. seguir, seguir hablando. Por ejemplo, eh, digamos oh, que okay. tú preguntas, what type of movies do you like? And I say, I like action movies and eh, drama movies, for example. The movie eh, oh. Adventure, Marvel, eh, Captain America. Ah, I like that movie. Okay. Entonces, ese for example te va a dar la oportunidad para que tú digas un nombre de película que te gusta o nombrar alguna comida que te gusta. For example, pizza. Okay. For example. Okay. So practice that. Excellent, Ocean Teacher. Thank you. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, so, two minutes, two minutes. Movies and adventure and action. What type of food do you like most? Um, pupusas, pizza, hamburgers. Uh, what type of book do you like to read? I like read about um, adventure, or novels, sometimes novels. Okay, good. Uh, what kind of video do you watch on YouTube? I watch um, music and I watch um, videos about to learn English. To learn English, okay. Um, ahora, Emerson le pregunta a Carlos o Carlos a Emerson. Okay. Creo que ya no nos va a dar mucho tiempo, solo tenemos 30 segundos. Ok, eh, les voy a dar un tip. Cuando quieran amplificar más su, su respuesta, quieren ampliar la respuesta, you say, for example. for example. What type of food do you like? Um, I like Mexican food. For example, I like um, pollo con mole. Or for example, I like tacos del pastor. El pastor. I like uh, burritos. What type of movies do you like? I like action. For example, I like... Y ahí uno dice la respuesta. Ok. Si quieres me preguntas ahorita en la sesión, Carla. Let's okay. go back to the session. Bye. Ok. Welcome back. Eh, Carla, do you have a question? Eh, you're on mute. Yes, yes, okay. yes. Uh -huh. eh, how do you say eh, libro de superación? Self-help book. Self-help book, okay. Self, Thanks. como propio. Help. Propio. Mm -hmm. Self-help books. Book. Okay, thanks. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, eh, le estaba diciendo a algunos que cuando quieran ampliar la, la, su respuesta, pueden decir, for example, what type of movies do you like? I like dramas and action movies. For example, I like Avengers. Ah, okay. For example, I like Titanic, my favorite movie. Okay. Or you say, uh, for example, what type of... Uh, books do you read? I like to read positive books. For example, y ahí, un, ahí uno tira algún título, al nombre de algún libro, al nombre de algún, alguna comida. Okay? I can, teacher, I can say psychology book. Yeah, 
Yeah. For example, eh, tanatología. Ajá, uh -huh. me das un título. Yes, very good. Okay. Okay, very good. Excellent. Now, I want to go back now. Eh, eh, finishing up. Esto no, no, no terminamos ayer. But I wanted to show you this. Different ways that you can say I like. Okay, for example, I like to read books. I love to read. I adore reading. Okay, es diferentes formas de decir I like. Okay. Um, I am addicted to reading. I am passionate about reading. I can't get enough of watching movies. Okay. It's my thing. Esa es mi cosa. Esa es la cosa que me gusta. It's my thing. Okay. Very good. So, eh, frases que se usan en el, en el inglés día a día. Right? I like it. I love it. I am fond of it. I enjoy it. Okay. Very good. I want to go back now to, um, I want to show you the, the, the activity for this video is pronunciation. So in the platform, if we go back to the platform, uh, there's a video here. We're going to listen to this video and it says pronunciation, okay? Uh, muchas veces nos podemos enfocar sol solamente en la teoría del inglés. Pero es importante también la música del inglés. Okay? It's like a, a person that, that plays the piano, ¿verdad? Una persona de que toca el piano tiene que saber cómo leer las notas y también el ritmo y intonación. So, for English, it's the same. Okay? We have the grammar. It's very important porque sin la gramática no va a salir but also you have to have the music of the language, okay? So this video, no sé si algunos ya lo vieron, but it is about pronunciation, okay? So let's watch this video. In this lesson, participants would listen, notice, and use intonation in questions. Pronunciation. Intonation in questions. Part A. Listen and practice. Yes, no questions usually have rising intonation. WH questions usually have falling intonation. Do you like pop music? What kind of music do you like? Okay, so now that you have listened and paid attention, what I want you to do is to record your voice asking these questions. Try to do your best. Remember, rising and falling intonation is important. Try to do your Okay, very good. Now, uh, these questions that are here, we can practice, okay? Quiero ver si puedo quitar esto. Let me see. Yes, I think I can. Give me a sec. Okay, aquí está. Okay, these questions here, uh, el video nos dice, grábense, graben su voz en el audio, en su teléfono, eh, para ver si tienen la intonación correcta, ¿ok? So, what we can do here is we can practice, ¿ok? So, I'm going to call on one person, uh, let's say, uh, eh, the video, solo para, para explicar, it said, when you have yes or no questions, intonation, you go up. WH questions, intonation, down, ¿ok? Intonación para arriba, for do or does, questions, or yes or no questions. Intonación para abajo con el WH questions. Okay? So, Emerson, how would you use intonation for question number one here? ¿Cómo la dijeras tú? Do you, like, do you like to watch TV? Yes, mm -hmm. suena bien. Do you like to watch TV? Okay going up right okay mm -hmm. uh, carlos number two question number two do you like music mm, no suena no hay mucha intonación trata de subir el tono en lo que vas 
completando la oración. <coughs> okay. Do you like music? Uh-huh. Better. That's much better. Okay. Do you like music? Do you like music? Very good. Okay. Gladys. Eh, maybe you can help us. Number three. Question number three. Intonation. A musical instrument. Eh, can you repeat? Do you play a musical instrument? Uh -huh. Do you play, uh, sorry, do you play a musical instrument? Uh -huh. Going up, right? Yendo siempre para arriba, terminando arriba. Do you play a musical instrument? Okay. Very good. Okay, now, ahora vamos para abajo. Uh, who can do it? Manny, can you do number four? Okay. <clears throat> what program do you like? What programs do you like? Repeat. What programs do you like? Mm -hmm. Ahí está. Very good. You're going down. Okay. Uh, next. Uh, who else do we have? Uh, Carla, number, question number five. What videos do you like? What videos do you like? Bye, para abajo. What videos do you like? What videos do you like? What videos do you like? Okay, very good, very good. And let's see, who else do we have? Anineve, question number six, going down. Which musical instrument do you play? Okay, very good, very good. Okay, so uh, I have here an activity that we're going to do, okay? Let's go to, I want to play this video for you. This video is very good, okay? It's, it's another teacher, all right? But it's a it's an American teacher, all right? So she's explaining very good. I want you to Did you go to the party? What did you bring to the party? Party? Party. In this American English pronunciation video, we're going to look at which questions go up in pitch at the end and which ones go down. The questions that go up in pitch at the end are yes-no questions. So questions that start with words like did, does, is, and can. Questions that go down in pitch at the end are all other questions. So let's look at some yes-no questions. Did you pick up the groceries? Groceries? Did you pick up the groceries? going up and pitch at the end. Does the store open at one? One, one. Again, the pitch goes up at the end. Does the store open at one? Can you lend me a dollar? Dollar, dollar. Can you lend me a dollar? And now questions that can't be answered with a yes or no that go down and pitch at the end. How are you? How are you? Why did you leave? Leave, leave. Why did you leave? Where are the keys? Keys, keys. Where are the keys? Who are you calling? Calling, calling. Who are you calling? Which one did you buy? Buy, buy. Which one did you buy? Let's look at pairs of questions. Can I borrow your book? Book, a yes-no question going up. Where's your book? Book, book. Not a yes-no question going down in pitch. Book, book. Can I borrow your book? Where's your book? Did you go to the show? Show? Rising intonation for that yes-no question. How was the show? How was the show? Falling intonation on a question that does not have a yes or no answer. Did you go to the show? How was the show? Did you see Amanda? Manda, rising intonation. When did you see Amanda? 
Manda, Manda, falling intonation. Did you see Amanda? When did you see Amanda? Don't forget this simple rule. Yes, no question, intonation goes up. Any other question, intonation goes down. That's it, and thanks so much for using Rachel's English. Okay, very good. Basically, what she's saying is yes or no questions, you go up. For WH questions, the intonation goes down. Okay, so let's do let's do a practice. Okay, I'm going to do here. Let me see. I'm going to do the same questions, and I want you to practice the question. Can I borrow your book? Okay. This is going to go up. Up. Okay. The other question, what type of books do you like? This is going to go down. Okay. So let's practice. Okay. Uh, Emerson, en una tienes que subir. En otra tienes que bajar. Okay? So, uh, read the questions to me. Um, can I borrow can I borrow your book? Uh -huh. Can I borrow your book? What type of books do you like? Okay. What type of books do you like? Can I borrow your book? What type of books do you like? Can I borrow your book? What type of books do you like? Okay. All right. Another question. Okay. Uh, did you see Amanda? Where is, where did you see Amanda? Okay. One, question number one here, sorry. You're going to go up. Okay. Question number two, you're gonna go down, okay? ¿Quién se atreve? Who can do it? Who can do it? Huh? Did you see Amanda? Did you see Amanda? Did you see Amanda? Uh-huh. Where did you see Amanda? Okay. Where did you see Amanda? What did you see, Amanda? The first one, la primera, William. Did you see Amanda? Did you see Amanda? Where did you see Amanda? Where did you see Amanda? Okay, very good. Carlos, practice. The same. Read the same one. Uh, did you see Amanda? Did you see Amanda? Where did you see Amanda? Okay, más o menos. All right, better. Gladys, can you do it? Uh, did you see Amanda? Where Where did you see Amanda? Perfect, very good. Escucharon la diferencia. Can you do it one more time, Gladys? Repeat. <laughs> did you Did you Did you see Amanda? Where did you see Amanda? Uh -huh. Ahí está. Escucharon? Did you see Amanda? Where did you see Amanda? Up and down, ¿verdad? Okay, so we're going to go do an activity. ¿Recuerdan las preguntas que hicimos al inicio? Okay, algunas eran does, las primeras eran does and do, y las otras eran wh. Okay, so I want you to go back in groups. Y quiero que practiquen haciendo las preguntas esas. With the rising intonation and then with the falling intonation. Okay? Let's go. Five minutes only. Five minutes. Let's go to this session. Um, let me see. I have five people because Carla had to leave.
Eh, ok, no tienen que responder las preguntas porque ya, ya la hicieron. Solo quiero practicar. La entonación. Uh -huh. Ok. ¿Quién va? <risa> do, do la dama like, primero. Ok, ¿cuántas okay. hay? Solo una. <risa> Qué mala onda. Este, ahí no estoy de acuerdo con la liberación femenina. Este, do you like rock music? Uh, does your mom like classic music? Do you like scary movies? Do your parents like rancheras? No. Do you like enjoy Chinese food? Do you ahí, like... ahí me equivoqué yo, Gladys. Solo tiene que ser una, una palabra. Like or enjoy. Do you like okay. Chinese food? Uh, do you like Chinese food? Or do you like going to the beach? Okay. Do you like going to the beach? Esas todas van con entonación hacia arriba. Hacia arriba. Uh -huh. Do you like going to the beach? Does your mom like rancheras? Uh -huh. Okay. So, siempre esa para arriba. Okay. Practice. ¿Quién va a ir después? Next. Yo, yo teacher, intentaré ahí. Go. Do you like rock music? Mm, empieza desde... Desde do y camina hacia arriba. Do. Do you like rock music? Uh -huh. Better. Do you like rock music? Do you like rock music? Uh -huh. Está bien así. Sí. Continue. Does your mom like classical music? Okay. Does your mom like classical music? Does your mom like classical music? Does your mom like classical music? Okay, good. Do you like scary movies? Do you like scary movies? Do you like scary movies? Eh, es que estás haciendo esto, mira. Estás haciendo... Du, 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 du. Eso es lo que estás haciendo. <laughs> Do you like scary movies? Estás haciendo esto, mira. La, 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 la. No, es de un solo. Es, do you like scary do you movies? Like, do you like scary movies? Ajá, solo que ahí va plano. <laughs> do you like scary movies? Do you like scary movies? Ok, yeah, está mejor. Better. Mm -hmm. do, your, do your parents like rancheras? Ok, good. Ok, do every, like, oh, perdón, one more. Do you like... Uh, enjoy China food. Ah, do you like China food? Sería verdad. Ajá, ahí se, me, me equivoqué yo. Solo una palabra, like or enjoy, la que quieras usar. Do you like do Chinese like food? China food. Do you like China food? Do you like China food? Do you like Chinese food? Chinese. No do China. Like China es, es el país, pero Chinese es el, la nacionalidad. Chinese. Do you like Chinese food? Ah, very good. Ok, ahora va Emerson, your turn. Ok. Do you like rock music? Um, does do your you mom... like rock music? Do you like rock music? Oh, it's rap, perdón, me equivoqué. Do you like rap music? Do you like rock music? Okay. Uh, does your mom like classical music? Okay, better. Do you like scary movies? Do your parents like rancheras? Do, do you, uh, does, I eat does, right? No, do, do your parents like rancheras? Mm -hmm. Okay. Do, do you do you enjoy Chinese food? Do you like going to the beach? Okay, very good. Ahora van a hacer esto. You're going to take one, take one, uh, hold on. Take one question con do in one question with WH. Okay? Take one question with 
do and one question with WH. Y la van a decir juntos. Es decir, eh, for example, do you like rap music? What type of books do you like? Okay? Para que en una suban y en otra bajan. Okay? Try it. Gladys, try it. Take one question, do, and one WH. Hey, you're on mute. I'm sorry. You're on mute. Uh, do you like scary movies? Uh, what, what type of movies do you like? Okay, good. Did you guys hear? Okay. Do you like scary movies? What type of movies do you like? Okay. So, practice. Agarren una con do y una con wh. Y los demás tienen que escuchar. Listen. Up, down. Okay? Go. Practice. Two minutes. <laughs> y ustedes ya lo dijeron. Ay, oí. Sí, ya lo dijimos como cuatro veces. Ya más o menos. Ok. <laughs> Now, you're going to do this. Ahora, agarren una con do y una con wh. Ok. So that you can go, for example, do you like scary movies? What type of books do you like? Una van para arriba y la otra van para abajo. ¿Ok? No. Practice. Agarren un, una de con do y una con WH. Las que sean. ¿Ok? Ok. Manny, you ready? Ok. Do you like, a, do you like Chinese food? And what kind of video do you like watch on YouTube? Okay, good, good. Mm -hmm. Okay, Nineve? Mm, do you like rock music? What, uh, what, type, what type of food do you like most? <laughs> okay, good, good. Okay. For example, you say, uh, Did you have fun? What type of movie did you watch? Okay. okay. Try it, try it. Uh, again? So? Yeah, una de cada una. Do... Uh, Do you like scary movies? Do you What like scary of... movies? Do you like scary movies? Do you like scary movies? Mm -hmm. What type of food do you like? Good. Okay. Okay, okay go. Who's next? ¿Quién va? Next. Okay. Uh, <coughs> ahorita voy. Come on. Do you like going to the beach? Yeah. What kind of books do you like to read? Okay, good job. Do you do you see the difference? Nota la diferencia. Do you see it? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay, very good. All right, let's yes. go back. I have okay. one more activity for you. Uh, ya vamos a terminar. So let's go back.
Okay, very good. So today I wanted to focus on intonation, okay? It is important in English, okay? Por qué? Because you can have very good grammar in English, but if you're speaking English like this, it's very boring. Oh, boring. That's why you. Okay? So you can have good grammar, but you need to have good music, good intonation. Okay? Because you need to. So I want to show you a video. Okay? It's only two minutes, three minutes. This is a person that's doing an interview for a job. Okay? Because I know that you want to use your English for work, right? One day, ¿verdad? Quieren usar su inglés para abrir puertas. So I want to show you this video. Uh, let me share my computer screen with you. Uh, listen to this interview. Uh, this interview here is for work. Let's listen to this. And Hola a todos, mi nombre es Héctor Contreras. Uh el gusto de estar con una excelente alumna en el cual queremos compartir nuestra experiencia para ayudarte a ti a alcanzar tus metas. So, tell me about yourself. Hi, my name is Lili Miranda. I'm 19 years old and I'm doing my second month in advance. And I'm learning a lot of things. Oh, good, good. Hey, tell me, Cindy, have you ever studied English before? Well, as a matter of fact, I went to a public institute. However, I didn't learn anything because, you know, it's better to be or she here. So all those things, but I didn't learn anything. Oh, okay. And tell me, Cindy, uh, how was your life before knowing English? Well, it was so difficult for me, especially because uh, I didn't like uh, English and I didn't want to study English. However, when I came to e 4 cc I realized that English is so important for you, not only because you can improve your life, but also you can do a lot of things and you and you're improve your self-esteem and your mentality. Because let me tell you, mentality is so important when you want to achieve your goals. Hey, great. I like to uh, listen to that. I like to listen to that. Uh, tell me, uh, Cindy, how do you feel now? I feel so proud of myself and I feel so blessed to be here. And I really feel uh, that I am capable to do whatever I want. So tell me, Cindy, what are you doing to improve your English? Okay, very good. Uh, basically, it's a, it's a video, right, of someone using their English for an interview. And the importance of the music of the language is important that you have that music okay so la gramática está bien pero también agreguemos la pronunciación intonation okay very good so there's a there's a lot of things that you can do something that you can do for pronunciation okay for intonation listen to shows in english listen to music in english Listen to movies in English. Listen to conversations in English. Okay? Aunque hablen un poco rápido. It's okay, but you can do it. Try it so that you can see the intonation that, that they use. Okay? Music, shows, TV, radio, anything that you can listen to in English is going to help you with pronunciation and intonation. Okay? All right, very good. Um, ya hicieron el exam de la de la mitad el midterm ya lo hicieron yes yes okay algunos ya lo hicieron excellent la mayoría creo que ya está y la encuesta también ya yeah. también okay very good yes. uh, creo que ahora le mandaron una un correo electrónico revisaron mm, sí y qué qué mm. era los detalles del siguiente curso sí para la inscripción Para la inscripción del siguiente curso, ok, so, eh, que sería eh, Pre-Intermediate Module 2, ok, Pre-Intermediate uh, Module 2, ok, so, okay. ya empiecen a, a, a arreglar todo, verdad, so, I know you're going to continue, right, ok, okay. Eh, if you want, in YouTube, eh, yo, me, yo estaba viendo algunos videos de los grupos avanzados en este programa, advanced groups, okay? And let me tell you, eh, no hay 30, <laughs> ¿verdad? <laughs> Por veces hay la mitad. Pero, they sound very good. 
okay? Very good. Their English level is very good, okay? So uh, this program works, right? And for you to continue or not with your goals. Okay, questions? No? No. Okay, very good, all right? You guys have a good day, okay? Have a good night, I'm sorry. Have a good night and take care, okay? Good night. Thank All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night. Thank you.